guys, it's Kendra and Dustin, and we are back with another Yokai Detective Co. episode. So, we fulfilled our end of the deal, I guess? I don't know. Was it a deal? I don't know. Anyway, we fulfilled our goal, and we were able to make Sada scary and famous and blah, 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 blah. So, it looks like she'll be sticking around for, I guess, forever. I don't, until we die? I don't really know. But, <laughs> to make things even more complicated, I guess we're going out on a date now. Yay! Our sister is trying to fix this up. <laughs> With a demon or well, spirit. No, spirit. <laughs> Evil spirit? Because she's not inhuman. She's I don't a, know. It's complicated. Well, if she's an Onryo, she's supposed to be a spirit that's been consumed by rage. Right. <laughs> So, Don't get it with her. No. But that is what an Onryo is supposed to be. Also, again, we come to the same. Can she change, like, her clothes or her shoes? Well, lack there of shoes. Hair. What does it mean if we're going to date? Because she doesn't age? I, I, lots of questions. <laughs> lots of questions. What about Fran? Anyway, <laughs> hopefully all of our concerns and questions will get answered. Or we're just not supposed to think about it. I don't know. But uh, let's get into it. <laughs> Continue. Dish one. Right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, eh, I don't remember what happened. She said, number two, oh, take oh, number that's one right. on we're the playing date, the King's and you game. You wanted to leave it there for right. the cliffhanger. Yeah, it is a good cliffhanger. <laughs> <laughs> good job, pass me. Anyway, <laughs> let's go. Oh. I'm number one. Hey, it's decided then. If you want to play the king game, then the king gets to decide what the subjects do. And I made you guys go on a date! Which, you know, sounds weird, but actually used to happen in the past. They'd be like, I like you, and you need to get married. Let's find you a wife. Um, that lady. You guys go on a date now. <laughs> and everyone was like, okay. <laughs> Your chaperone will be this person, right. and your chaperone will be this person. Yeah, that's literally what they used to do. <laughs> kind of weird. And that's why the, like, families would be like, Hey, king, you want to marry our daughter to somebody cool? <laughs> or, hey, queen, you want to set our daughter up with somebody rich? <laughs> <clears throat> anyway, I made you guys go on a date. And that's so, <laughs> I'm so happy... Do you know the song from Mulan? <laughs> oh, yeah. I wasn't sure if you were going to go with Mulan or um, Fiddler on the Roof. Have you seen that? I haven't actually my seen it. My high school Fiddler did it, and that's why I saw it. <laughs> I keep meaning to. It's on it's my pretty list good. It's pretty to... good. I like the music. It's just, yeah. I also don't know what one to see, you know? Yeah. <laughs> When you when it's a play, you know. I've never so seen many, the movies. It's like which version of the play should right. I watch? If you're gonna watch Family Opera, you best watch the 2000. I think it's 2004, 2005. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> anyway. <laughs> which adaptation is the best? One? Yeah, I don't know. Like I said, I never saw the movie. Just saw it in high school. It was good. Um. Oh, is your line? No, no, you can't do. <laughs> Subjects, silent subject. I will accept no complaints on the matter. She's getting really into this. <laughs> she really wants her. Yeah, apparently. <laughs> well, that laugh definitely says she's my sister. What? A date with Sada? I looked at her. She was just wide-eyed, looking intently at her chopstick. Is she happy about it though? Like. I don't know, that phrase is all pink. Right, but like in a good way, or in like a I'm flustered way. Um, does she think if she looks at it hard enough, her number will change? Gone. <laughs> Did she just look at me all flustered? <laughs> How adorable. Ah! Wait, what? What am I thinking? <laughs> Somebody has a crush. Eh? 
You're probably thinking Lady Sada is adorable, aren't you? Oh, what? <laughs> so it's decided then. You two will go on a date tomorrow. No, oh, no, no. A date, huh? Again, how is this gonna work? Is she gonna, like, how does it, she eats? We could go out to eat. Uh, again, the whole no shoes thing, no. Are we gonna be able to go to a restaurant? <laughs> or like, I don't know. A date with Sada? I guess. It'd be interesting. I closed my eyes and fell asleep. What? Oh. Oh no, it was wet. <laughs> wet and smooth. I'm guessing Good. it's- Yeah! <laughs> it was hitting my face. Supple. Warm. Wait, no, I'm not falling for this again. Shut up, kid. Let's not wake up the others. I had to rub my eyes first to see Chizu clearly. Everything alright, Chizu? Yeah, I just need you to follow me. We, I need to talk to you. This is gonna be like when the dad like intimidates the 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 date when he comes to pick up his daughter or whatever. And it's like, oh, listen, boy, you have her home by what's a what's a good time? Nine o'clock. <laughs> I don't know. Nine's pretty. Nine early. is kind of early. Five. Ten o'clock. I think it's usually ten. <laughs> uh. Boop. 3 a.m.? What could he possibly want to talk about at 3 a.m.? And why couldn't it wait? What is it, Chizu? Oh. <laughs> uh, just wanted someone to watch over me while I pee outside. Is this also an intimidation <laughs> tactic? Or it's a dog thing. Oh, yeah, they do look at you when they pee. Because they're like, if I don't want to get attacked in this vulnerable state. Odin does it. Jesus. What, just because I'm an Inugami, I can't be scared of the dark? You can pee inside, though, yeah? Like, you have hands. Couldn't you just use the toilet? I don't know. He might not have any... There are some dogs who do that. I've seen it. On the internet. Ha ha ha. Wapow. So, what's the reason you got into this yokai business anyway? The reason? Yeah, the reason. Why do you call yourself a yokai detective? You don't really strike me as someone who just do this for no reason. The reason. Hey, that's easy. I. It's because I wanted to find out the secrets of the world. You know, the reason I entrusted Lady Sada to you is because you're pure of heart. Okay, so does that mean he caught us in a lie? Or is he going to compliment that that's our reason? Um, uh, from the tone, I'm thinking, it sounds like we lied. I kind of wondered if it had something to do with our parents, because they're dead, right? Seems like it. Let's find out. Ah! <laughs> Still, that's the first lie you ever told me since we met. Is it our parents? First lie? What? How did he... Relax, kid. I'm sure you have your reasons. Your secret's safe with me. What? Still, I'd prefer if you answered my question. I tried to hide it, but Chizu probably saw my bewildered look. I'm an Inugami kid. I can tell when people are lying. Question. What? What's an Inugami? Well, pulling it apart... You said dog man. Would be dog god. Oh. 
But what does that have to do with telling, like, are they some kind of, like, judging character in some kind of mythology or something? I know there was the one guy on Bleach who also was a dog. Oh, yeah! The captain! Yeah. Yeah! Oh. I don't know. I've never heard but, of yeah, it. Yeah, I don't... I'm not familiar with the mythology. Of Me, neither. Me neither. Me <laughs> hmm. That's what attracted me to Lady Sada in the first place. She's the first Yure I ever met who had a pure heart. Most Yure aren't like that. So what is it? Why do you do it? It's my sister. Ever since our parents died, Nana has always been afraid of Yokai. She was just a little kid, so of course she would be. But she was inconsolable. She thinks Yurei took our parents, and she was so scared she'd stop, she stopped going to school. So that's why you did it? If you showed your little sister that you are an expert in all things yokai, then she'd think her big brother is going to protect her from them. You're alright, kid. You have a pure of okay. <laughs> you have a pure of heart as well. I supposed I suppose you could take care of Lady Sada for me when I'm gone. Oh, wait, where are you going? When you're gone? Look, kid. I've been around a long time, and you're the one human ever to help Lady Sada. I think I can trust that you'd take care of her. What are you talking about? Kid, do you really think... She'd just pull you in that TV if you fail. Well, no, but what are you talking about? <laughs> what? It's me, kid. She was worried about me. She's thinking if she's gone, then I'd be all alone in that TV world, as you call it. It's the only reason she threatened you. She wants me to have a companion if she ever disappears. Until the end, she cares about the people around her. Well, I guess in this case, the dog around her, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Inu gave a boisterous laugh. Lady Sada has always been nice to me. The only Yurei to actually keep me company. I'm an Inugami kid. I'm immortal. She can take my spirit anytime and live forever. Does she not live forever? Mm -hmm. But she doesn't. She'd rather have a friend than save herself. Oh... She lives forever because, you know. Of the people, story? Yes. Uh, okay, I see. So she could have taken the easy way out and just. Yes, like, that was the thing. Or whatever. Remember, that was the thing. He's like, maybe we should. And then okay, she was like, yeah, no, yeah, we yeah, can't yeah, yeah, do yeah. that. Yeah. Gotcha. When she was disappearing. She. I made peace with it, Ko. If you fail. I'll need you to take care of her for me. We won't. Huh? We won't fail. But didn't it already succeed? Yeah, but I think we have to keep the story going. So got it, got it. You know, how far, how long can that go? Right. <laughs> I shouted, my voice ringing around us. You're her only friend. You're our friend. We can't lose you. Would you rather lose her? Oh, the idea of Sada fading away again. 
It's okay, kid. It's okay. If it comes to it, I'll sacrifice myself for Lady Sada. Hmm. Relax, kid. You have a date tomorrow. Yeah, so why'd you spring this on me now? <laughs> the next day. Going for an announcer voice? Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't really sure if I was ready. I felt overdressed. I should have worn my other shirt. Come on already, big bro. Stop overthinking. No one pushed me out of the house, forcing me to go and walk forward. Good luck, okay? She's already waiting for you in the cafe. <gasps> in front of Fred? <sighs> okay. Wolf, wolf. It's just any other day, right? That's what Nana said. Nothing to be worried about. Same sky, same sight, same kind of day. Ah, no. It's not like any other day. I have a date with Sada. Wait, no. She's only going along with it because of that Silly King game yesterday. I don't know. Yeah, that, that's it. This isn't a date. It's just us playing along with Nana. Sada's probably just going because she wants to indulge Nana. Yep. Totally not a date at all. I stopped in the middle of my walk, noticing the bench to my left. It's the same bench Sada and I had a first proper conversation. Feels like centuries ago. I smiled and continued forward. Is this going to be like a walk down memory lane or something? No. Clutching my gift in my left hand. Wait, I have a gift? I guess it's a date. Are you supposed to bring gifts to dates? Like flowers or something? Maybe. Is it too much? To have a gift already for your first date? I don't know! I mean... It's nothing much. It's just an empty journal. But this is for Sada. The girl who traveled through time. The girl who's eager to try new things and enjoy life. Wouldn't it be the perfect gift? A place where she can write about her new experiences? New things she sees? A place for her to craft her own story? Untethered from her previous worry. It seems like a sick joke for such a fun-loving spirit to be designated as someone who needs to scare people. But I guess life is unfair sometimes. It doesn't matter. She did it. And she did it in her own time. It made me smile, reminiscing about it. And before I knew it... Oh wait, are we there? I don't know. Alright! That is where we are going to end today's episode. Right before the date. I don't know how this is going to go. I really don't, and I'm kind of nervous about it. Also, I don't know why Chizu decided to have this very important conversation with us the night before. But whatever, I guess. <sighs> anyway, hopefully... I don't know. I kind of thought that that was the end of that, and then we were just gonna go on a date, and it was gonna be like a cute ending. But now I'm like, is it not? Is she gonna start fading again, or is that just something to remember in the back of your head? I don't know. I'm on a date. This I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> I hope you guys are enjoying this game. If you are and you want to check it out for yourself, there's a link in the description below. Um, if you like this game i don't think that we have a i don't know we have other games that you should check out i don't know if we have any quite like this one but we have a number of other games go check them out I they're mean, a lot was... of fun <laughs> they're cool they're we got a lot of different genres so just peruse around if you want to see a short version of them before you hop in you can always go and check out our TikTok that I will start to post on again. We also have an Instagram. 
that you should check out. Also, we stream, but we don't stream this particular game, but we stream a number of other fun games every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So, you should come say hi if you want. Um, but yeah, I think that's everything. So, like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you feel like doing. We will appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!